Brandon McCreary became an overnight sensation five years ago when he competed on season 10 of American Idol and won it. It's been five years since then. The number of uh, self-proclaimed McCreerians, as his fans <laughs> like to call themselves, have continued to grow along with the sales of his music. But now at just 22, Scotty can add author to his resume with the release of his new book about his life. And it's called Go, go Big or Go, go home. home. The journey toward the dream. Great to see you Hi, again. Hi, Scotty. Scotty. Oh, yeah. with that oh, was that fun. Was fun. That was fun. Thank you all for having me back. What, you, what made you want to write a book at 22? In a while, yeah. in a while. You know, they came to me at, uh, at 18 or 19 and said, you want to write a book? And I said, I'm, I'm too young for that. I ain't, yeah. I ain't done enough. And I'm still young, so that's why I don't, autobiography is a weird term for me. Yeah. I, Lord willing, I want a lot of life left to write that. But I feel like I had some experiences to start sharing that story, so yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. and it, an inspiration to other young people that they think that just because they've come from a small town and oh, no, yeah. they're, they're, you got a big dream. Is this yeah. what you wanted all along from the very beginning? It was. I wanted to be Elvis Presley. I'll never be that cool, but I can <laughs> pretend sometimes. But, uh, but yeah, it was. That started when, early for you, right? It did. Five yeah. years old. Five when years we old. look at the Wall of Fame that we have behind us, yeah. I see you as a little boy, but I see lots of pictures of you playing baseball. Yeah. Sports was your other love, wasn't it? It was. It yeah. was. That's where kind of the go big or go home thing started for me. Uh, you know, I was a pitcher, and, and my dad kind of instilled that that motto in me, you know, if you're going to go out there, give it your all, mm -hmm. and uh, kind of make that transition from pitcher to musician and artist and, and kind of carry that same mantra. At what, time, at what age did your voice change? Oh, boy. Uh, it, it, about the same time as everybody else, 12, 13, 14, but it skipped the cracking stage. So it was just one, 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 hey, down. and it's, hey, how you doing? So, yeah. Imagine this apparent surprise one day all of a sudden. You must have freaked. Man, well, you get one hair on your face. Hey, Mom. How you doing? When it came to American Idol, you were going to try out, and your, was, your, was it your mom who encouraged you and said that you should do this thing? Yeah, you know, I've watched the show since season two when Clay was on for Raleigh. Um, but yeah, you know, I, I, you just don't ever think that thing can happen. You know what I mean? So they, they showed me the audition dates, and I didn't want to go to this date because I had a retreat I didn't want to miss to go get cut from some TV shows. So we flew to Milwaukee with Dad's frequent flyer miles, and it, wow. it all worked out because they kind of gave me that extra push. That's wow. great. Well, That's you are such a kind guy in yeah, addition you're, to being you're, you're so talented. Well, God you. bless you. You're going to come sing for us. I would love to if you allow me to. Oh, yes, so good. Just... Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.